Vlogmas day five? Yeah, four or five. Coming in hot from Orlando. Three, two, one. Woohoo! Oh, oh. We made it! We're really close. We just gotta find shades of green now. We're just a couple minutes away. We're gonna check in, get our room, and then put all our stuff down, maybe change clothes, and then into a, take a nap. Into, <laughs> in, into, take a nap. Into a swimsuit? No, I don't oh, think we're gonna change our swimsuit tonight. It's getting dark, it's gonna get a little bit chilly this evening, so I think we might put on long sleeves and then try to get on a bus and head over to Disney Springs. What? Ooh, Aladdin bus. Jasmine. We thought we could hop over to Disney Springs, get those coins, and then get our memory maker and get that taken care of and out of the way. I can show you guys the bus stop. Um, it's probably gonna be dark, so it might be a little confusing, but I will do my best to show that, or at least describe where it is. That was super cool. I don't know if he's gonna be here every day. Um, we might have just gotten lucky, but they said he was gonna be here from four to six, and we just made it. It's like quarter to six right now, so we got lucky, didn't we? Yeah. We're gonna park in the parking garage. We got the Magnolia side this time. And I got a bungle. And Story got a toy from Santa. So we're gonna park and then um, take all of our stuff to our room since we're on the Magnolia side we do have a little bit of a hike it's not, that bad. it's not terrible but it's not like being on the palm side when you're just right here but this way we'll be closer to the pool here we are <laughs> loading it down I don't know what we're gonna do when we don't have a stroller anymore because this uh, has <laughs> even when she's like 10 I don't care. It just comes in handy all the time. Okay, can you handle your suitcase? Yeah. Okay, can Daddy push and take one luggage? I'll take one and I'll push. Okay, and I'll take, I'll take this one. Just because you're in shades of green, so I gotta lock the truck. Mm -hmm. Lock it up for safety. So we're parked on level two, which I believe is this, um, is this marine? cameras so there is surveillance oh here we go here's what I was talking about so level one army we're on level two marine navy air force and coast guard you can pay for parking right here if you're not staying here if you're just a guest a guest of a guest there's Santa again. Since we're on the Magnolia side, we parked, and then we have to walk through the lobby. This is where we checked in, and where we saw Santa. So at check-in, you just turn right here. This is the Java Cafe or the Starbucks and the gelato. And then the garden gallery downstairs. And then through here is the exchange at the end of the hall. Look at 
this story. Look, look at this Mickey. Look how cute. <laughs> we'll go see this a little later. Down here, the attraction tickets. That's where you get your tickets if you don't have them already. And then we're gonna go through this little bridge or walkway. Look, I see, there's a pool. That thing that is bugging underneath here. Yeah, we're on a bridge. So when we get to the elevator down here, we'll get on and go up to the third floor. Three fourteen. We're to the right. So this is a good five to ten minute walk, depending on your level of athleticism. And to the right again. To the right. To the right. Oh, the right. It is kind of muggy in the hall. Maybe that's because it rained all day. Oh, this is super nice. So we're at the end of the hallway right here. And then just out this door is the Magnolia Pool. You're doing great, honey. Good job. Is that it? That's it. Are you, are you, are you and Daddy actually next to me? Yep. You'll sleep there, and we'll sleep here. I don't want I don't like this room. Why, no. princess? I, I, I want my own bedroom. I want my own one. <laughs> well, mommy and Daddy couldn't afford that this trip. Do you know how many times we've been here this year, honey? Uh, Enough. Yeah. So sometimes you got to travel on a budget. You need to be humble, okay? Aren't you glad we're here? Yeah. Yeah. So today is the 30th. So 9 30 a.m. is the first bus and the last bus is at midnight. Operating hours is from 10 a.m. to 11 p.m. So just because it says midnight, uh, 11 p.m., that's the last ride. So it's very important to keep that in mind. We will double check that with the driver. And we will double check that with the driver once we get on the bus too. So I wanted to see that, see what time, how long we could stay at Disney Springs before we have to get a Uber back. <laughs> also with the bus, when you check in, you get these little, um, make sure there's no PII on here. So you get these little guest cards, right? It tells you like your names and then uh, two adults, one child, right? So you get two IDs, one for me, one for Ash. And it also has the dates. It's valid until your uh, checkout date. Whenever the bus pulls up, they'll want to see these they'll, with your ID. The lady at the counter told me you can take a picture uh, with your phone and have it, you know, of, of this, take a picture of this with your phone and then use that. They were not allowing that before, so we'll check that out too. All right, going back down to the lobby, which is level two. And then from there, Dad, do you, want, do you want to see something, Daddy? We're going to find the bus. Do you want to see? Watch. Watch. Somebody has been Watch. cooped up in Ready? the truck for Ready? six Watch. hours, Watch. so she's got to run Whoa. and move. Show me how fast you are. <laughs> That's pretty fast. This is neat. They put a little pin trading thing on their door. No, no, leave it alone. But in case anybody else has any pins they want to trade, they can just put one there and take one. So from the the main entrance where the lobby is. There's some stairs that will lead you down through all these really pretty waterfalls and you can go down there to get on the bus. Or right over here is an elevator and that'll take you down too. And it's all nicely labeled for you. So, we just came down from right up there. That's where we got on the elevator. So like I said, you can come down the steps if you want to. And then to get to the bus, we're gonna go right through here. So whenever you come out, if 
you walk straight through, there's a little board right here that'll tell you which bus you need to get on. So if you go to the left, you're going to the Magic Kingdom in Epcot or the tra Transportation and Ticket Center. And then to the right is the Disney Springs bus. And that also goes to Animal Kingdom and Hollywood Studios when they're open. There it comes. Disney Springs. We're gonna sit in the back, like the cool kids. <laughs> so, there was a bit of a delay. Um, it's 7.15 and I think we got down here at like 6.45. So we had a little bit of a wait. I think it gets pretty crowded, like traffic wise, over by Disney Springs at nighttime. So just kind of plan for that if you're gonna do the same thing. We're back on schedule. 7.30, on the dot. It's 7.30 on the dot. <laughs> Diamond! We're even now! We're leaving! Family of the bus. Family of the bus. <laughs> Alright, we have made it to our destination. 7.43. So it took about 13 minutes. Not bad at all. So here's what the bus stop looks like. There's the Shades bus. It was stop number 5. So if you're looking for it coming back, just look at Cirque du Soleil, and it's kind of like right behind it. Last pickup is at 11 o'clock. But they run till midnight, and that they, what the paper said? They run till midnight. However, the last pickup here is at 11 o'clock. So, and that's then, what I would aim for. Yeah. We finally made it, and we won. If you missed the 11 o'clock, they got lifts on the other side. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I will say, for the first time doing this, I was kind of afraid of being able to find Disney Springs, <laughs> like, in the dark, or just find the path in the dark. But they have lots of signs all over the place. They are, yeah, they're pretty fast. We're in! What do you think they have there? m ms Stop that. It's snowing! It's snowing! <laughs> you got snow in your hair! <laughs> if you look up at the lights, you can really see it. She's a beaut. Okay, let's see if we can find the medallion machine in here. I just really feel like we saw it before. But I guess we didn't. Okay, apparently it's over by the Pandora stuff, all the jewelry. It's definitely busy in here. I do kind of want these Crocs. I've never owned a pair of those before, but they do look comfortable. All fuzzy inside. How much are they? Oh, 65. Right there. I like this shirt. This is cute. It's like pieced together. <laughs> Here's the Pandora stuff. So it should be over here somewhere. Oh, there it is. Right behind this little section over here. So there's the door. And it's right behind the jewelry cases. Okay. One, two, three, four. Good job. So we got Cheshire. Mickey. Oh, that's Gus Gus. Or, oh, that's Jacques. I, no, I got Olaf. And that's Olaf. And then who's the other one? That one's Gus Gus. Yeah. All right. Okay, we had to make a pit stop real quick because they have this really cute little popcorn tin that's actually a music box. So the popcorn and the beer was $37.50. So a little steep. It's pretty steep for popcorn and a beer. However, you can get this refilled with popcorn at any of the parks for like two dollars, I think. Now it'll be it's hard to hear, but it's a music box. Yeah. So now, 
We are going to go get our memory maker. Okay, we've got a quick pit stop for some food at BB Wolf's Sausage Co. Well, I have a hot dog. A hot dog. With ketchup on it. Hot, a plain hot dog with ketchup, which was a number five. Well, Mama got the plant-based option, number nine. It's got sauerkraut and mustard, and I think that's it, but it's on a really good soft pretzel bun. And then I got a beverage, Bex. It was 42 bucks. It's kind of steep. I don't know why everything's so steep around here. But we have to go to guest relations after this to get the memory maker. It's on our way back out, which is fine. Rainforest Cafe. I want to take Story here and see how she reacts to it. Uh, we've always had fun there. The carousel is closed. Uh, yeah. yeah. They're going up. Okay, okay, they see we finally made it to the Welcome Center. So, if you're coming here looking for this, look for Zara. Okay, here's a better idea. Look for the big tree, if it's at Christmas time, and then just go directly behind it. There's characters in flight right there. And we're gonna go right in through here. Oh wait, this is like the tree. Disney Cruise Line tree. Yeah. How fun is that? Remember that slide? Yeah, that was fun. That is super cool. We've secured our memory maker for $98, no yeah. taxes. It's a flat 98. So normally it's $199, and it'll cover pictures we for your. We saved 100 bucks. Yeah. Dad, come on. It's a great deal. Okay, we are exhausted already. We're heading back to the bus. Here's Cirque du Soleil. So we're gonna follow this lit path all the way around to the bus stop. This is a hike. So if you don't wanna walk this far, you could always catch the Polynesian bus, get off there, and then walk across the street to Shades. Signs are going in the right direction. That's good. Our path is getting a little darker. But we know we're going the right way because here's the electric car stations. Past the rock that looks oh. like a long neck. <laughs> we made it. Link 312, bus stop 5. There it is. And it is 10.35. Blood light here. So, we only had to wait here for about 5 minutes. Excuse the crazy, um, but we're back on the bus at 10.38. He said we have about 20 minutes, so we're gonna hang out here for 20 minutes, and then his last shuttle is gonna be right at 11. So, we'll get back to Shades at 11. This one is probably still gonna be dancing, and we're gonna go to bed. Daddy's tired. He was carrying around our Lego thing and story all night. Alright, I made it back. 11.14. So 13 minutes to get there, 14 minutes to get back. So, if your little, little kids have a letter for Santa, they can mail it right here. We made it. Partied hard while you were gone. Ugh.